Parts of North Carolina and Tennessee had their first snows of the year this week, but only in the high elevations where it's coldest. For lower elevations, it's a little more complicated than just if the air at ground level is below freezing. So how do forecasters know if precipitation is going to be rain or snow? The 540 line is the spot where atmospheric thickness, which is a measure of distance between two pressure levels, in this case, the 1000 millibar pressure level at the surface and the 500 millibar pressure level higher up, is equal to 5,400 meters or 540 decameters. Colder air is denser, and so the distance between pressure levels is shorter, while warmer air has a larger thickness. Meteorologists have found that the 540 line is a good indicator of where the air is cold enough for precipitation to fall as snow. So generally, south of the line, rain. North of the line, snow. Obviously, there are a whole bunch of circumstances in which that's not necessarily the case, but we're just not gonna worry about those for now.